guys, so this is a self-spoken eating video. Today I have some cheesy pasta, um, a couple hard-boiled eggs, and some sunny delight. I have a day off work today, so I figured I would make an eating video and just talk to you guys. So how have you guys been? I've been sporadic about posting. Sometimes I post a lot and sometimes I don't post at all. A lot of it lately though is because the memory on my phone is full. I am I'm hoping to get a new phone today. It might not happen today because for some reason the phone stores by my house don't carry the big gigs. They only carry the little gigs and last time I was just impatient which is why I got a 16 gig phone and thought that it would suffice and it did not. Within like a month I had no memory. Because I take a lot of pictures and a lot of video. So. Yeah. Work's been pretty okay. I haven't been working much overtime. Actually. I have not been working any overtime. Um, and just so you know, if you hear any noises in the background, um, please excuse them. I can't help them. But I've been trying to sit at the dining room table and eat. And film some of my videos. Yes. A hard boiled egg and I did not excuse my ugly nails but I did not break these before the video and I suppose I should have um there might be some burn spots on them because um I actually cooked these in the oven in a muffin pan I put them in a muffin pan and cooked them at 325 for 30 minutes. Because I saw a video on Facebook and I wanted to know, see there's like little burn spots. But I wanted to know if this would work if I cooked them in the oven instead of boiling them in water and it did. I love eggs. They're like such good protein for you. As I slap food all over the place. But I don't know. I guess to me, I don't even know. I try new things. And if they work, awesome. If they don't, lesson learned. Um, 
I'm so over the political shit on Facebook. Like, I'm ready to just delete my Facebook and be done with it. People may, may be upset that Trump is president. But he is the president of the United States and there's nothing we can do about it. And I'm not saying that I agree that he's president. But a lot of the stuff that he's spoken has been spoken before and nobody had a problem with it. Now all of a sudden... America's got their panties in a bunch because it's Trump. Yet yeah, other leaders, such as Bill Clinton, have said similar things. And the world's fine with it. I don't know. I don't like talking about politics. Because I feel like you'll never agree. But for me, as unless you're new to my channel, um, I'm, I'm gay. So for people to come out and say, oh, you know, he's taking away all LGBT rights and this and that, which isn't true. It's basically people getting on social media and causing an uproar over things that Basically, someone else made up. You know, I'll be honest. No, I was not excited about having Trump as a president. But, one, I have no choice. He's president. Two, see if he makes a difference. You know, do I worry? Sure I do. You know, almost every single one of my cousins are black, Hispanic. So it's like, I worry about what the future holds for them. Yes, they are legal to be here, but... The world as a whole treats people differently just for being different. Like, you grow up and you're told, like, be an individual. Like, being an, an individual is, like, an important thing. Be yourself, you know. Don't feel like you always have to fit in. Like, you're told all these things when you're a kid. And then it's like you become an adult and you go into the real world. And you're like, that's not how it is. If you don't fit into someone's mold, then they're like, get out. Like, go back where you came from. So I feel like some of the things that we were taught as kids, the, they don't hold true. Like, that's how we get through our childhood. And that's it. So... Anyway, I'm full, so I'm going to go, but I just wanted to put a video up, and again, thank you for all my subscribers. You guys are amazing, and I will be back soon with another video. Bye, guys.